guys, it's Lee, and I'm back today with another acrylic pour painting. And I'm using the same colors I used in the last two videos. I will leave a link to those in the iCards and down in the description box below so you can find them. Today, I'm going to be doing a bottle bottom pour. And this came off a bottle of Hint Water, or this is a bottom of a bottle of Hint Water. I have an eight by eight canvas that is on what are these things called? Push pins to keep it up off the table. And the colors, like I said, I'm using, I'll just tell you quickly, black, white, purple, blue, gold, and silver. So I'm going to start with white. This white is pretty thin now. Hmm. We'll see how it goes. I want lots of white down. Just because I want it to go over the edges, I saw a couple of clumps, that's not good. Oh no. I'll be right back once I strain my white. Okay, I strained it, so we should be good to go now. So next I'm going to put down a little bit of black. And hopefully the, the clumps will just get poured off the edge. A little bit of gold. Blue, the blue and purple have also, also have some iridescent medium added. Okay, I'm gonna let this sit for a few minutes and let all the paint sort of do what it's gonna do. And then I will try to remove this without messing it up and tilt it a bit. It's 
pretty. hate to tilt it but I know there's way too much paint on here and it'll crack so take a good look at it now <laughs> because it may not be pretty later all right wish me luck Before I do too much more, I want to get some paint on these edges so that when the paint flows over, well, you know, it'll have somewhere to go or something to flow into. give this a quick torch I have to change my battery and I'll be right back all right I'm back I'm gonna tilt this a little bit more oh, I hate to do it I almost dropped it. That would have been really bad. You know what? I'm just going to leave it how it is. I'm going to move this over to a place to dry and then I'll give you the close-up. Okay so here is the close-up. I think this turned out gorgeous. I think I'm gonna try another one actually and then I'll have two with the same colors that kind of go together and I think that would be awesome. So here it is a couple of days later and it's dry and I think it is just as beautiful dry as it was when it was wet. I'm gonna to try to show you the edges because I think they are really cool as well, the way it just continues over the side. And I know that's kind of the point of this kind of painting, but it doesn't always work out for me. So yeah, I really like this. All right, um, oops. I'm just gonna give you a close up of the whole thing. Very, very pretty, I love it. All right, so let me know in the comments section below what you think, and please give my video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and also hit the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. And you can also find me over on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. Bye.